Yeah, what's going on, Nerd Sanctum fam? Welcome back to the Sanctum and some more of Mass Effect Legendary Edition Let's Play. Still in this mine or wherever the heck I left off at, uh, I figured this was going to be a pretty easy one to get through because we're just going through all of the different planets in the different areas and just kind of exploring them and everything. So <laughs> I don't know if we're just, I don't know if we were almost done or what, but I figured if we're going to be going further into this mine, we're going to go up. Nope, we're going down. So yeah, looks like we're going to be in this mine for a while. <laughs> okay, that's not good. This thing better not be breaking on me. We just keep going further down. Maybe. Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. Are you okay? What happened to you? Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? There's some kind of repulsion field in the way. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Any suggestions on how we can help? There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. All right, a little bit some exploring. Oh, already, already. Okay, hang on. Let me get, let me get my sniper out. Anybody else? Is that one? Oh no, no. You guys are firing at somebody. Where? Oh. Won't you turn your back on me, boy? Hmm. Why won't you just die? <laughs> Sheesh, man. Oh, pansy. Pansy robot. Oh, can I get him right? I'm just trying to see if I can get it right over the head. Nope. Okay. Is that all of them? I think we're good. If there's any containers nearby that I might be able to loot. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a code as an override sequence. Nice. That, 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 okay. That, 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 that. Oh, okay, so I think it's this. Boom. Can't do anything with that one. the override I swear I'm gonna mess one of these up one time like when I first started playing and I did like the very first let's play episode I definitely messed up I was like oh okay well, maybe I'll just be able to redo it nope <laughs> it was like well that sucks all right so we killed all those guys one over here Hmm. Can't get up there. Huh. 
not like a door or anything? I know when this thing went off, it it shot something out. Okay, so we just have to go back this way. Okay. I just want to make sure we're covering all bases, you know? Would hate to miss something. Oh. Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We have to get you out of here before more Geth arrive. Yes, you're right. I've seen enough of them to last a lifetime. That button should shut down my containment field. Do it yet, dude. I wanted to find out why. Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit, but I don't know. What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA eight minutes. He needs to move faster. If I die in here, I'll kill him. All right. I guess we're just going to trust her. It's too quiet. Surrender, or don't. That would be more fun. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Hand the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. She'll stay with us, thanks. Not an option. Saren wants her. And he always gets what he wants. Kill them. Spare the Asari if you can. If not, doesn't matter. That guy's fast. What? No way, dude. I could have sworn I killed him. Son of a biscuit. I thought I killed him. Maybe I just Ah, oh, man. Kill him. Spare the Asari if you can. If not, doesn't matter. Trying to make him my top priority. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's what I'm saying, dude. I must have knocked him down. You guys are lucky. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes. It's a coping mechanism. You'll get used to it. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. If the Protheans weren't the first, then who was? I don't know. There is barely any evidence on the Protheans, even less on those who came before them. I cannot prove my theory, but I know I am right. The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, this isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Of course, you're right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture. But I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. 
Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her bionics will come in handy when the fighting starts. Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate? Or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Yes. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Liera's on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. Right, not bad, not bad. That actually gave a good good bit of information. And even a little bit more about my character. I like it. Let's see if, there, if these guys have anything. If anyone has to take over for Captain Anderson, I'm glad it's you. I'm not sure about having non-humans on our ship, though. I'm in charge here, Presley. I decide if we have non-humans on this vessel. Yes, sir. Understood, sir. How did you end up assigned to the Normandy? I signed up with the Alliance as a navigator right out of school, following in my grandfather's footsteps, I guess. My first posting was on the Agincourt. We were at Elysium during the Skillian Blitz. A massive fleet of alien raiders hit the colony, trying to wipe it out. They had the numbers, but their ships were no match for an Alliance frigate. It was a slaughter. We couldn't even keep track of how many ships they lost. How'd you end up on the Normandy? I got my officer's commission after Elysium. Must have made an impression on the right people. Captain asked for me when he was picking his crew. Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. I'm just going to do a quick explore of the ship. Yeah, here. Codex. What Joker's up to? Uh, I prefer gold to silver, you know, for my metal. I figured you'd recommend me for one since I uh, pulled your boots out of the fire. <laughs> if we present you with a medal, you'll end up sitting on stage listening to politicians make speeches for a couple of hours. Fun, fun. That's a good point. They'd probably make me shave, too. I spent the last seven weeks working on this baby. No medal's worth that. So, Commander, why don't you tell me why you're really here? I like to know my crew. Mind if I ask you a few questions? <laughs> I can see where this is going. You did a background check on me, didn't you? Well, I'll tell you the same thing I told the captain. You want me as your pilot. I'm not good. I'm not even great. I am the best damn helmsman in the Alliance fleet. Top of my class in flight school, I earned that. All those commendations in my file, I earned every single one. Those weren't given to me as charity for my disease. I'm sorry, Joker. I didn't even know you were sick. You mean... You mean you didn't know? Oh, crap. <clears throat> okay, I've got Vrolich syndrome. Brittle bone disease. The bones in my legs never develop properly. They're basically hollow, too much force, and they'll shatter. Even with crutches and my leg braces, it's hard to get around. One wrong step and crack! It's very dramatic. But I've learned to manage my condition, Commander. Put the Normandy in my hands and I'll make her dance for you. Just don't ask me to get up and dance unless, you know, you like the sound of snapping shin bones. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
I need to know more about this Vrolik syndrome if I'm putting my ship in your hands. Yeah, of course you do. It's an extremely rare condition. Nobody knows exactly what causes it. Genetic, maybe. It's treatable, but there's no cure. They classify my case as moderate to severe. I was born with over a dozen fractures, hip, thighs, ankles. My bones were already breaking in the womb. A hundred years ago, I wouldn't have survived past my first year. Lucky for me, modern medical science has turned me into a productive member of society. I love Joker right now. I'm not trying to make you uncomfortable. Let's talk about something else. Whatever you want, Commander. Why does everyone call you Joker? It's a lot shorter than saying Alliance Flight Lieutenant Jeff Moreau. Plus, I love to make little children laugh. You're dodging the question. Look, I didn't pick the name. One of the instructors in flight school used to bug me about never smiling. She started calling me Joker, hmm, and it stuck. I have to go. All right, see ya. All right, I mean, that's, gives us a little bit, a little bit about him. I do love, I do love that though. Like his personality is freaking awesome. The sarcasticness of inside of his personality, I think is pretty cool. Man, he jumped to conclusions so quickly. He thought like I knew. What Good we timing, were... Commander. We got a transmission coming in from the Citadel. Top priority clearance. Mm, definitely patching that. I'll take it in the comm room. Commander Shepard. We've received information that may be critical to your mission against Saren. What kind of information? We've received an urgent message from one of our infiltration regiments in the Traverse. You mean spies? Spectres tend to attract attention, Commander. But they are only one arm of the Council. Special task groups are often a better option for monitoring developing situations. We currently have several infiltration units scattered throughout the border regions of Citadel space. This particular unit was gathering intel on Saren. What did they find? Unfortunately, the message we received was little more than static. The infiltration team must be in a situation where they can't set up proper interstellar communications. But the message was sent on a channel reserved for mission critical communications. Whatever they were trying to tell us, we know it was important. Considering your interest in Saren, we thought you might want to investigate this. Find out what happened to our team. The signal originated from the planet Vermeer. I'll look into it. The Council prefers not to become involved in the specifics of Spectre activities. We only want you to be aware of all your options, including Vermeer. Good luck, Commander Shepard. We will keep you advised if we learn anything else. Nice. Let's see here. So in our journal, <clears throat> so that got added to it. Let's see what we got in our assignments. So uh, we were originally still going through all these different planets. I, I feel like we, I feel like I need to stick with that course. So let me see where we are. Let's see if we have any planets that we have to survey or anything like that. I mean, we may have to go back to these in the future, but as of right now, like, I can't go to them, so any of the ones that just kind of show me information, I'm just kind of, like, skipping. So I want to kind of move uh, move up through all the other other ones that we're missing. There's none out here. Oh, look at that. There's one all the way over here. Sweet survey. Scan of gas. Uh, detects is a large concentration of nitrogen. Very nice. Got that one. Let's go over here. So we're still in the Artemis system. We could find it here because I think Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. How many casualties so far? 
17 Marines were killed in the simulation exercises before we realized what had happened. That's when we contacted you. VI support is critical to our military success. They process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. But as advanced as this thing is, that military strategy is still just a VI. It's not self-aware, and it's completely disengaged from any networks. That's where you come in. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI core and manually disable it. Can't you disable it remotely? Our fail-safes aren't responding. The VI operates on a closed network. It can affect any external systems, but we don't have any direct access to its processes. We could bomb it from orbit, but the damage to the facility would be catastrophic. We'd prefer to have someone shut down the core. Someone like you. I know Spectre's answered the Council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military, and right now we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck. All right. All right so let's survey this one. Ooh, a large amount of free oxygen. Hey, now. A whole planet of free oxygen? Yes, please. Helium-3. This one has nothing, so we'll back out on that one. Let's see, skin of the planet Pharos revealed an abandoned base on its moon. A recon team found nothing of interest, but much of the debris was marked by the Magna Colony Cigna. Any other ones out here? This one. All right, so Thalamus. Nothing in this one? So there was nothing for me to travel to? Really? That feels odd. So we did that one. Went to this one. We went to that outer one. Really? You can't even go to... The okay, so we went to that one. Hmm. Alright, well I guess that... Well, there is none in this one. Okay. Try this system. I wanted to double check just to make sure. Alright, so this one we do have one we can go to. Alright, so we'll, we'll come back to that one. Any on the outer rim. We'll be surveying. What do we got? Large concentration of Xenon? Xenon? What do we got for this one? Let's see, we're scanning the planet of Orlin. Strange signal came from orbit. Navigators presently determined that the signal was from an ancient beacon. Your salvage team brought the beacon aboard and found out that the matriarch Dilinig Dil Lin Nag Oh, whatever. Writings It's in this okay, whatever. Some type of storage compartment. I freaking hate that I can't like sound out words. English is hard, man. Alright, let's go to this planet. Let's check our map and see what we got on here. Alright, so that's us right here. So, go to the debris first. Since that seems to be the closest for us. This guy right here. I knew I was going to have to like hit buttons and stuff, but I'm like, oh man, I'm going to screw this up, aren't I? <laughs> All right, next one. Stronghold, huh? And then Anomaly. 
do the anomaly first. Because, I mean, I would think that the stronghold, you're going to be there for a while. So we'll save that for last. this? Type of closet? We made a large deposit of Loremio. Oh, freaking! I, I, you know, I'm I'm done. <laughs> I'm done trying to announce these freaking things. I'm just gonna. I'm just. I'm just not even gonna try anymore. <laughs> It's not clear who lived here, but it appears to have been abandoned for some time. The container in the tent held, among other things, one of Matriarch's writings. Is there anything else, since this would like to be more campsite? Alright, let's go say hello to the welcome party at the Stronghold. Mark that bad boy right here. I just randomly shot. I didn't know where the dude was. Where's the door? Ah, there it is. Lossy, I home. Oh, he doesn't even know I'm here. I see him. Ah, oh, damn it. You suck. <laughs> damn, these guys are beefy, man. <laughs> Stupid pirate and you're possibly coming back to life type crap. No. No, sit down. They did. Come on, poke your head out. Do it. Wait, whoa, whoa, hold on. my elbow bro damn 
this chick, dude. Where'd she go? Why's well, everybody got to do all the teleporty thingy? Where'd she go? Oh, for the love of God. Oh, can I just shoot this thing? Is that what that's telling me? I don't want to stand there. <laughs> Alright, guess we're going to the door. Well, uh, actually, let me over... I'm going to go over here and explore this real fast. Go this way? Yes, you did. But she didn't do all the teleporty thingy. Just ran away. Over here? No. Yeah. For all the free stuff, I appreciate you. Really? Skill level two level you suck. You discovered evidence that the uh, I know they said the name before, I just can never figure it out. Whatever. The people are leading these slavers and Nas Nas Nana, whatever. People. Creatures. Whatever. An important ambassador on the Citadel are sisters. You should return to Presidium Presidium, whatever, and confront whatever evidence. I'm sorry, guys. I just have a really hard time trying to break down words. Well, I don't normally read that type of stuff, but I figured I would do that on a Let's Play, you know? Alright, we're just going to go back into the Normandy. I kind of wish that, like, you could just instantly do that. Um, like, when... You're, uh, when you're ready. Where's this bottom door? Where's it go? Other one. Yeah, I wish, like, you could, um... Can't blow that up. I also can't open it either. No, it's a fuel tank. But yeah, I kind of wish you could just instantly fast travel to your uh your one area that you wanted to go to. How do I get up there? Ready. How did I... Uh, excuse me, how do I get that? Oh, whatever. Yeah, I wish you could just fast travel to your, um, ship. Or just happen to go all the way back outside. Let's see. Anything important out here. here. Not just a bunch of rocks. 